Hello folks, Bronco Bob here with Texas Best Used Motorcycles. Here today to show you a really cool car. A great piece of Cadillac history. It's a 1969 Cadillac station wagon. And only five of these cars were ever built. And they were painted British racing green with a faux alligator trim on the interior. And General Motors built these cars and used them to chauffeur executives and important people to the Indianapolis 500 race in 1969. After the race, the cars were transported to Dallas, to a Dallas Cadillac dealer, and they sold all the cars. And this would end up going to California. And in 1998, the owner had the car rebuilt and repainted and restored. So it's a 20 year old paint job, but it still looks pretty amazing. And under the hood looks very nice. One thing he didn't like was the 69 grill. So the grill is out of a 1970, and that was just a customer preference at the time. The car is very, very long and very, very cool. It rides on a set of torque thrust chrome wheels and some red line radial tires. And what I really like about it is there's no B pillar. So it's like a hard top, and then you got the wagon back. It just makes it really interesting. Also has a, a power sunroof up top and a roof rack. So when you go to Wally World, you can put grandma on the rack. The paint, again, is very, very nice, but if you look real close, you can see a few little few little chips, few little places, and granted it's almost a 20 year old restoration. A few little cracks here and there, but again it's overall pretty, pretty nice, pretty fantastic. And there was a coach company that would get the cars from the factory, and if you look online there's nobody really knows who actually did the coach work on it, but it's a, a great piece of Cadillac history. And it's really car art, but it's fun. And I don't know how many are still on the road today of those five that were built. This is probably going to be one of the better ones. And there's some information online that, you know, a guy had it restored and he was real picky. He popped this hood. The engine is a 472 cubic inch. It's a Cadillac motor. It's rated at 375 horse and it's over 400 foot-pounds of torque. Look how wide this is. I mean, those fender tubs are just gigantic. And if somebody wanted to put some airbags on this car and set it on the ground, it wouldn't be that hard. The air conditioner does work. It needs a charge. It's blowing cool, but not cold. Uh, the alternator was recently replaced, and the tune-up parts, plug wires, etc., were recently replaced. But otherwise, um, a nice body on frame restoration done in 1998. Wow, that was 22 years ago. British Racing Green. I guess that would be appropriate for the Indy 500 race. But a really cool car. The bumpers are just massive. It's just a cool ride. I'm going to start it up, let you hear it. Of course, it's let me get the key out of the back here. It does have a power window on the back. And it'll roll up and down, but you just kind of got to help it a little bit. It's trimmed out real nice. That back seat folds down. There's the power window. Needs a little silicone lubrication, but you kind of got to take one hand and give it a hand, and it'll go up. Cool back bumper. It's got 1969 Texas plates on it. Cadillac wreath and crest, which they've changed that design. And again, I love the hard top look. But we'll start her up. It floats down the road like a big old boat. It's, show, it's showing 5,483, 85 miles. I'm sure that's 100, 105,000, unless they reset it when they did the restoration. I just, I just don't know. I like to say the air is blowing, it's just not blowing cold like it should be. 
Really cool interior. A sign of the times, Cadillac in 1969. There is some wear on this bolster for, from getting in and out of the car. You can kind of see that. Again, it's not terrible, but it's there. Just kind of walk around the car. The hood is huge. I think I'm going to turn the lights on. See what the lights look like. Yeah, you can see the side marker lights, the amber ones. Coming around the front, your headlights, the turn signal lights. Almost looks like a lantern. But man, what a cool car. It's long like a limousine. It was probably a soccer mom dream car in 1969. I guess, did kids play soccer in 69? I don't even know. There's Cadillac traditional tail lights. And then you can see the uh, license plate light. British Racing Green 1969 Cadillac station wagon. And it sounds to me like the muffler might have a little hole in it. It's just kind of making that little noise. When I get it up on the lift, I will check that out. But if you want to have one of the only ones at a car show, you show up in this, nobody's going to have one. This is really cool. If you have any questions, give us a call. We're Texas Best Used Motorcycles, Mansfield, Texas. We'd love to ship you this car. We can ship anywhere in the USA or anywhere in the world. This is going to take a really big trailer to haul this one. Have a great day. I'm Bronco Bob wishing you happy trails.